Today on Nostalgia Hit, we look back at the cast of the 1991 American adventure drama film Thelma and Louise. We'll revisit the actors and update them as of 2023. Please remember to subscribe to the channel for your daily dose of nostalgia. Also stay tuned until the end for 5 amazing film facts. Harvey Keitel played Hal. In 1991, Keitel was 52 years old. He was born on May 13, 1939, and is now 84 years of age. In a career spanning more than 50 years, Keitel has starred in numerous Broadway and off-Broadway shows, and films which include Taxi Driver, Pulp Fiction, and The Grand Budapest Hotel. He has several projects in post-production, and has recently starred in the action crime film The Baker. Christopher McDonald played Daryl. In 1991, McDonald was 36 years old. He was born on February 15, 1955, and is now 68 years of age. McDonald is also a stage and voice actor who has appeared on Broadway, and whose most notable film and TV roles include Quiz Show, Happy Gilmore, and Harry's Law. He has recently appeared in two episodes of the action drama TV series Secret Invasion. Stephen Tobolowsky played Max. In 1991, Tobolowsky was 39 years old. He was born on May 30, 1951, and is now 72 years of age. Stage and screen actor Tobolowsky's film and television appearances include Groundhog Day, One Day at a Time, and The Goldbergs. Recently, he has provided voice roles in the animated TV shows The Loud House and Animaniacs. Brad Pitt played J.D. In 1991, Pitt was 27 years old. He was born on December 18, 1963, and is now 59 years of age. Pitt is a multi-award winning actor and producer who has starred in films which include Interview with the Vampire, Twelve Monkeys, and Once Upon a Time in Hollywood. One of his most recent roles was in the 2022 comedy drama film Babylon, where he played Jack Conrad. Timothy Carhart played Harlan. In 1991, Carhartt was 37 years old. He was born on December 24, 1953, and is now 69 years of age. Stage and screen actor Carhartt is known for appearances in Island Sun, The Hunt for Red October, and CSI, Crime Scene Investigation. Between 2018 and 2020, he had a recurring role in the drama western TV series Yellowstone. Lucinda Jenny played Lena, the waitress. In 1991, Jenny was 37 years old. She was born on April 23, 1954, and is now 69 years of age. Jenny's film and TV appearances include Peggy Sue Got Married, G.I. Jane, and The Shield. Her most recent role was in the 2022 crime drama movie DOA, where she played Grace. Jason Begay played a state trooper. In 1991, Begay was 31 years old. He was born on March 12, 1960, and is now 63 years of age. Begay's film appearances include Monkey Shines, G.I. Jane, and The Next Three Days. He is probably best known for starring as Hank Voigt in the drama TV series Chicago PD, and for recurring appearances in Chicago Fire, Chicago Justice, and Chicago Med. Shelley Desai played the East Indian Motel Clerk. In 1991, Desai was 55 years old. He was born on December 3, 1935, and is now 87 years of age. Desai has appeared in films that include Barb Wire, Here Comes the Boom, and Paul Blart, Mall Cop 2. His most recent role was in a 2023 episode of the comedy TV series, History of the World, Part 2. Carol Mansell played a waitress. In 1991, Mansell was 44 years old. She was born on October 1, 1946 and is now 76 years of age. Mansell's film and television appearances include Down to Earth, In the Light of the Moon, and a series of unfortunate events. Recently, she has appeared in two episodes of the comedy TV series, Night Court. Sonny Carl Davis played Albert. In 1982, Davis was 45 years old. He was born on February 2, 1946, and is now 77 years of age. Davis has appeared in over 80 film and television roles, some of which include Last Night at the Alamo, Fast Times at Ridgemont High, and Bernie. 
He recently reprised the role of Rabbit in another installment of the comedy horror Evil Bong film series. Marco St. John played a truck driver, which was uncredited. In 1991, St. John was 52 years old. He was born on May 7, 1939 and is now 84 years of age. St. John's television and film appearances include Balfour, Friday the 13th, A New Beginning, and Monster. His most recent on-screen role was in the 2022 TV mystery, Blackwater Blues, where he played Big Tuna. Michael Madsen played Jimmy. In 1991, Madsen was 33 years old. He was born on September 25, 1958, and is now 64 years of age. Writer and producer Manson has provided voices in numerous video games and is known for his roles in films such as Reservoir Dogs, Donnie Brasco, and The Hateful Eight. He has recently appeared as General Coda in the war movie Assault on Hill 400. Susan Sarandon played Louise. In 1991, Sarandon was 44 years old. She was born on October 4, 1946, and is now 76 years of age. Multi-award winner Sarandon is known for appearing in the Rocky Horror Picture Show, The Client, and Dead Man Walking. She has several projects in the pipeline, and her most recent role was in the romantic comedy movie Maybe I Do, where she played Monica. Gina Davis played Thelma. In 1991, Davis was 35 years old. She was born on January 21, 1956, and is now 67 years of age. Academy Award winner Davis is also a producer, who has appeared in films which include The Fly, Beetlejuice, and The Accidental Tourist. She recently played Munka in the 2023 drama film Fairyland. Now, for 5 amazing film facts. After auditioning 5 times for the role of J.D., George Clooney made it to the shortlist but lost out to Brad Pitt. The final scene in The Grand Canyon was actually shot in Dead Horse Point State Park, Utah. The flying Thunderbird car scene was nailed on the second take, which was a relief to the crew, as they only had three T-Birds lined up to use. Gina Davis and Chris McDonald were previously engaged, and Gina recommended him to director Ridley Scott for the part of Daryl. Both Susan Sarandon and Gina Davis were nominated for the Academy Award for Best Actress, however, they lost out to Jodie Foster in The Silence of the Lambs. Imagine you could go on the ultimate road trip with any actor on the planet. Which actor would you choose to join you on your adventure? Let us know in the comments below. Thanks for watching Nostalgia Hit. Please remember to subscribe and hit the like button if you enjoyed the video, as it really helps the channel. Why not watch another video listed on the screen now? Until next time.